Dear students, under the topic Integral Calculus, we are now going to learn Bernoulli's formula. To understand this more better, if you go through the concept of integration by parts, it will be more helpful. It is available in the playlist, so kindly go through it and understand the integration by parts methods and then you can try to listen Bernoulli's formula. The formula is given by integral u dv is equal to uv minus u dash v1 plus u double dash v2 minus u triple dash v3 plus etc. If you see the signs keep alternating that is the first term of this series has a positive sign. The second term has a negative sign and then the third term has a positive sign and then a negative sign. So it keeps alternating and if you see we have u v multiplied together as the first term and in the second term u dash v1. So what is this u, u dash, u double dash, u triple dash? u is a function and u dash, u double dash and u triple dash are differentiation that is uh, when u is differentiated one time, it is represented as u dash. When it is di differentiated twice, it is represented as u double dash. And thrice, it is representation uh, represented as triple dash. And v, v1, v2, v3 is the integral of, for example, v is the integral of dv. v1 is the integral of the function obtained uh, from uh, integral dv, which is v. Similarly, v2 is the integration of v1 and v3 is the integration of v2 and it keeps on going like that. Now, what is this I-L-A-T-E? This I have already explained while learning about integration by parts, but still I will explain it once again. This gives us the order of selection of the function u and v. We will try to understand it more better by looking into this problem. So here we have a question which says, uh, says that evaluate integral x to the power 4 e to the power x dx. Now here we have product of two functions x power 4 and e power x dx. Now we have to decide which function has to be chosen as u and which function has to be chosen as dv because this is of the form integral u dv. So now in order to make that decision, we have to choose u in the order of this. That is, i stands for inverse, l stands for logarithmic, a stands for algebraic, t stands for trigonometric and e stands for exponential. So in this order, we have to make the selection of u and whatever is remaining that will be selected as dv. Now, for example, here we have product of two functions where one of the function is algebraic. Whenever we have terms like polynomials, x power 4, x power n, x power 5, etc. It will be considered as algebraic. And whenever we have terms which involve e power x, we, we call it as exponential. So here we have product of an algebraic term and an exponential term. So when you see here, uh, where does this uh, algebraic comes and where does this exponential function comes? Exponential function comes after algebraic function. So, the function u to be selected is algebraic first and after that dv will be exponential. So, if you see here, x power 4 will be the function u and e power x dx will be the function dv. So, the function x power 4 has to be selected as u and whatever is remaining after making a selection of u has to be taken as dv. So this is u and this is dv. So we have got the format integral u dv for which we can apply the Bernoulli's formula and we can evaluate it. Now we have got it in the form of integral u dv. So now we have to find u v u dash v1 u double dash v2 all that. So let us see how to do that now. First we shall write what is u given to us. So u given to us is u is equal to x to the power 4. Now we have to find u dash first. So from this if you find u dash it will be the differentiation of 
u with respect to x so it will be 4x cube then u double dash will be the differentiation of u dash with respect to x which is 4 3 times is 12 x square and the differentiation of u double dash is u triple dash which is equal to 12 2 times is 24 so 24 x and then further again we have to differentiate u triple dash so which will be u differentiated fourth time so it is represented as u to the power bracket 4 so this is equal to the differentiation of 24x so differentiation of x is 1 so it is 24 but it, since we have obtained a constant term we have to stop our differentiation because when a constant term is integrated i mean differentiated further it will become zero for that reason we have to stop our integration so when we find u uh, uh, differentiated four times we have to find v4 correspondingly so for that first we shall write what is dv so dv is equal to e to the power x dx so that we have to take and write now integrating this on both the sides we get what is integral dv it is v that is equal to what is integral e to the power x dx so it is e to the power x so we have obtained v which we can take and write here so v is equal to e to the power x next we have to find v1 from this v1 is the integration of v with respect to x what is integration of e power x it is e power x again then v2 is again the integration of v1 which is e power x again v3 is also the integration of v2 which is again e power x and v4 is equal to e to the power x which is the integration of v3 now why i am stopping here is because we have only till u differentiated four times so we have to stop v4 over here and the formula has to be stopped with this so let us write the formula that we are going to use now we know that the bernoulli's formula is given by integral u dv is equal to this now in order to apply this formula I have taken and written here and if you see uv minus u dash v1 plus u double dash v2 minus u triple dash v3 plus u4 v, um, v4 so I am stopping the formula here because u4 is a constant and after that when it is differentiated we will get 0 so we need not write the remaining terms that's why we stopped finding till v4 also now we shall apply uh, substitute all the values that we have found over here so the given integral is integral x to the power 4 e to the power x dx that is equal to first we have uv the first term is uv what is u we have got here u is equal to x to the power 4 and what is v e to the power x so we shall substitute that so x to the power 4 e to the power x minus the second term what is the second term u dash v1 what is u dash that we have obtained it is 4x cube and what is v1 it is e to the power x so we shall multiply these two and we shall write so it will be 4x cube e to the power x next we have u double dash v2 and we have a plus over here so plus u double dash what is u double dash we have obtained u double dash as 12 x square multiplied with v2 which is e power x so 12 x square e power x is what we obtain so 12 x square e to the power x then the next term is minus u triple dash v3 what is u triple dash we have u triple dash as 24x v3 is e power x so multiplying these two we get 24x e to the power x and then plus we have u4 v4 what is u4 it is 24 and v4 is e power x so we get 24 e to the power x then we shall simplify it by taking the terms that are common so if you see in all the terms e power x is common so we can write it as x power 4 minus 4x cube 
plus 12 x square minus 24 x plus 24 bracket and e power x is common in all the terms and in the final answer after integration we have to add the constant of integration c so adding c therefore integral x to the power 4 e power x dx has been evaluated by using the Bernoulli's formula I hope you would have understood how to apply Bernoulli's formula in order to evaluate the integral of the form u dv. In our next video, we will evaluate an integral where the algebraic and trigonometric functions are involved. So kindly follow the next video lecture. Thank you.